Hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel. Um, basically this video is a quick get ready with me. Uh, on my Instagram I put out, um, ask me some questions because I'm getting ready and you guys did so I basically just answered them while I did this cute Christmas look. Um, if you want to know how to create this look, stick around and keep watching and go like all my social medias. Okay, so let's zoom in a bit so you guys can see what I'm doing. I'm going to start with the eyes. So, I think I'll start with... I might just prime my face so that way it's ready to go. So I finally went and bought the Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Base. I've seen Jeffree Star talk about this forever. Um, so I finally got myself one. So I'm just going to start with that. With a damp beauty sponge, I'm just going to just apply that all over the face. can use my usual, my fave, my Gimme Brow from Benefit, as well as my Goop Proof Brow Pencil from Benefit in the shade 3.5. So I'm going to start filling them in. So let's start out with one question that I got was, what are you most proud of in 2019? Um, I think there's a few things like, you know, obviously not everyone has like the most fabulous year. Um, but, and one of the positive things that happened this year was definitely starting my makeup course. Thank God. Other thing is also, which happened towards the end of the year, was actually settling my land with my partner to build in the new year. I'm honestly so excited. Um, another question that came in as well was, um, what's the go with my diet and how I've been going and how I've been feeling? Honestly, I kind of take it like month by month um obviously working with kids like my immune system it has like it's up and downs um so i find like i'm a very much a carrier for bugs like i know like sometimes i bring bugs home and like my partner gets because of it even though i'm fine um so i've definitely like in regards to like my health i've definitely been going to like the gym about three times a week i try to do like one day like I'll focus my legs and then one day I'll do arms and then another one I'll do like full cardio or like floor workouts. Um, I know I already said it but I'll say it again. I'll definitely have a um, video up next year of how that's all been going. I originally was, um, how heavy was I? I was like 78 kilos. Like that's a lot. And I'm now down to 68. And in terms of food as well, people are like, what are you eating? I've been taking the, um, I don't do protein powder, but I've been using the X50 um, teas. And I really like the apple and black currant one. So I'll take that in like half a morning or like before the gym. I just feel like it helps detox my body as well as like get me ready for the gym. Not that I, like I can say like it helps me lose weight. Like I wouldn't say like it's a replacement to lose weight. I just feel like it's definitely been helping. It's got a lot of like vitamins in it and things like that so that will also help for breakfast i'll do like pretty much like three boiled eggs and a bit of like my and like my x50 tea and that's it one thing that's actually been helping me as well i'm not going to say that it like totally got rid of it because that would be an understatement it's not like a magical cream but i've been using the product of banging body um i saw it on facebook and on instagram and it was like on the korea mail as well like and it's this lady from Melbourne and she basically made this amazing cream that helps with um, cellulite and stretch marks. And um, I thought I'd give it a go because I do have a lot of cellulite on my thighs and legs like any girl. Um, but when going to the gym, I noticed like it was toning me, but I just need like a little bit of extra help. So I've been using that for about a month now and I'm not totally ready to show before and afters. I want to give it like another couple weeks, maybe then the new year and just show you guys how well it actually works. Honestly, like I'm dumbfounded. Like it's the best my legs and thighs have ever looked before. So brows are snatched. Um, concealer is done all over the face. We've got our primer. Um, let's start with the eyes. So what I'm gonna do actually for my Christmas look um, is a gold cut crease with a red lip. I know, so original, hey. So I'm gonna be using the I got this as a birthday present from um, one of my parents. It's the Morphe um, 35B palette. It's called the Stunning Vibes palette. And that's pretty much what I'm gonna focus on using today for my eye look. Here's the palette. And then from the company, the Makeup Workshop, 
I've got this hybrid sparkle. They are from Melbourne also. I'll put them on. I'll link them down below. This is called Silk Road. And I've got my NYX pigment primer. So that's definitely going to help make the pigment stick um, when I cut the crease. So I'm just going to set the eyes with just like a plain colour. The shade in Go Nude, which is pretty much this nude colour here. It's very peachy. I'm just going to apply that all over the lid. Fixin' is like this colour here. And I've just got my Morphe M573 brush. And I'm just basically going to whoo, load up my brush and just work into my crease. Okay, back onto questions. Um, Let's see. Um, another one is what do you have in store for 2020? So pretty much 2020 for me is definitely finishing my course, my makeup course, um, maybe starting, which I've actually found a few online, um, an eyelash extension course and do that. Um, definitely going to keep continuing working towards my goal and losing my weight. Um, but yeah. So that's pretty much me in the zone is the next shade, which is dark. Oh my God. Oh, my bedspread is now covered in the rainbow. A bit crazy, but we're going to smoke it out and we're going to cut the crease. So I've just quickly gone in off camera and I've just blended this out and I've just blended up as high as I can to my brow bone without looking ridiculous. <laughs> I'm just going to take this black color here, which is the shade Little Black. And I'm just going to slowly add to the outer edge and just blend in. Okay, the hammer was having some drama. So all I did was um, pack on in the zone in a vixen. And I just kept adding on top of each other and darkening. And then I got um, the shade Spice. Which is this shade here. Um, and I just started adding that on the outer corners just to make it a little bit more, I guess, smoky. Um, which is kind of what I'm going with a brown smoky eye. So I'm just keep adding that in. And just blending. Okay, I think I'm happy with that. I think I'm going to try and cut the crease. So I'm just going to take my Tarte Shape Tape now and just cut my crease. Alright, so I'm just going to try and cut this bad boy. Oh, do I do... Oh, do I do a halo eye? No, I'll do a cut crease. I'll do a... This primer is actually working. Oh my god. How cute that is. Aha! Oh my god. Okay. Booby tape. Okay. So a lot of people have actually DM'd me about booby tape. Um, like I said, I'm going to say it again for the 60th time. I am a big breasted girl. And I you know, trying to wear things to get, to like, make the girls lift is really hard. And obviously not wearing a bra isn't really an option for someone like me. Um, so how do I do it? And that's honestly with booby tape. They were on the news. They were everywhere. And I'd been trying all these different products um, to work, to like lift my girls up. I've used those ones where you like hold and pull and nothing seemed to work. Um, but then I found these guys on Instagram and I found that they actually stocked in Canvas Warehouse, like my local Canvas Warehouse. So I thought I'd just give it a go and um, sure enough, it's amazing. It honestly holds, it comes in um, three different colours, comes in beige, black and tan. Um, I've got the beige and the black because um, I like to just like toss, oh is it beige, beige, brown and black? I don't know. But um, it works so well and I can wear just about anything like any other girl could with smaller boobs and they look awesome. I usually push my boobs together and then up <laughs> and it honestly looks so good. Oh my god, I love it. Okay, so I'm going to take the M506 brush and just go back in um, with this shade here. I'm just going to add just a little bit on the outside edge of my eye just to blend in the glitter so it's not like a harsh cut crease. So I'm going to go back in on the under eyes 
that is the eye portion done so time for the face um as you know i applied the bobby brown face base one thing i've been loving lately is mixing my foundations mixing my favorite nars santa fe foundation and i'm mixing actually l'oreal true match so i've got a high end and a drugstore and i like to do three pumps of this and one of this i'm going to use the exo beauty um flat face brush i really like this one i think because i can really get in and you don't need a lot either. So I just like to do the stippling motion to begin with. And I'll just spread this all over my face. Okay, what's another one? What's one thing you've changed with your makeup since starting makeup? Um, one thing is probably, which I'm loving a lot more now, is my eyebrows. Um, I used to fill it in quite a lot and quite heavy um now i notice that i barely do it at all i like to leave the front pretty natural and then um i blend obviously with the arch and things like that i go very strong because i like to have a strong arch in my brow but yes as well as cream contour i absolutely love doing cream contour and you know what, when you i love using cream contour um i used to just use like a straight out bronzer and just warm up my face but I've actually been just loving just plain cream contour and nothing else. Okay, so now that I've got a base on my face, I'm just going to use the Huda Beauty Tan and Tone. And this is what I've been using the cream contour. I use it in the shade Light. So I like using this angled cream contour brush from Sigmets, the F61 brush. Um, yeah, it's got this big angle here so I can actually like cut my um, cheekbones. I love it. Just like so, and it just you know, slides so effortlessly. And then I obviously like to do like the three methods. So I'll do my jawline thingo and my forehead, and then I'll dip back in, and I'll do the other side. Another one is what clothing companies do you like shopping from? Um, honestly, I pretty much do like all my clothes shopping online now. I pretty much never go in the store anymore, only because I just, <laughs> as bad as it is, I can't be bothered. Um, and also there's just so much better quality stuff online than there is in the store. Um, so pretty much my go-to now is, um, Shein, which I love. So thank you so much to Tilly, my best friend, who introduced me to it, because she was like, you need to try it out and do a video. Because I was like, what even is this company? And I kept seeing, like, Instagram ads everywhere. So I love buying off Shein. I love buying off Boohoo. Um, and pretty much that's about it. They're, like, my two go-tos that I'm absolutely loving. Powder. I'm just going to use my MAC Studio Fix Powder in the shade NC30. It's just a simple compact. I'm going to use my regular Too Faced love flush blush in baby love i really need to get a new one it's starting to crack not cool okay what's another question what does a christmas look like for you christmas for me is pretty much getting up crack of dawn which is like for me 6 a.m that's the earliest i'll get up and um i basically get up like i'm like a child i get the whole family up in their jammies and we just basically have like a cup of coffee not me because i don't drink coffee even but um I'll make everyone a cup of coffee, which is like my mum and dad and my brother and my boyfriend. And we'll literally just sit around the Christmas tree and unwrap all the presents early in the morning. My mum would have been up already at like four, getting our turkey ready for lunch. We have a big family lunch. Um, so highlighter, this is the Luna Beauty Moon Prism one. This is the shade Venus. All right, and I'm gonna take the Morphe M510 brush, which is this small blender brush. I love it, it's perfect for highlighting. I'm just gonna highlight my brow bone. Now we've got left is eyelashes, mascara. I'm not gonna do any liner just because I don't wanna ruin the look. Um, and lips so I might add a little bit of like a white eyeliner in the waterline Too Faced Melted Matte one as well it's called Cinnamon Bear it's what it, they came out with last year um, and it, they came in like a pack of four
lipsticks on. Oh my god, it's so red. I just don't know if I like it. Oh my god. Mascara time. I've got the um, Benefit Big Girl Bang Mascara. Let's pop him on. I've got my EXO Beauty lashes. They are the gold dig lashes. I'm just going to stick them on. Okay, lashes are on. And we are done with the final look. So let me just zoom out just a smidge more. I'm honestly so happy with how it turned out. It actually looks so stunning. Um, I'm actually digging the red lipstick too. All the products I use, I will link in the description below. So, whew. so if you love these, get ready with me. So let me know in the comments below. Um, you know the drill. Go like, comment, and subscribe. Um, and I'll see you in, hopefully, my gift swap video.